but I didn't. Grand Finals. Oh, we're going straight into it. All right. We got the run back from winners, winners finals. And the same beginning stage as we saw the last time. Great smash DI on an up throw up air. Gets Stango out of what would have been a very damaging punish. Even presents here as we get into the first 20 seconds of Grand Finals. Here. Ooh. Here's the back throw. Down tilt. Is that that? that no. Ooh, oh, it is. All right. Not able to scoop him out with that back air. He Dave. messed up, but he got rewarded anyway. Sometimes that happens in Melee. Right, Sometimes they just mess up a little bit more than you do. All right. Wait, the, he needs his edge guard. Oh, that, that was clean. Real bad. Oh, yeah. Clean. Real fast. He's just right there. That was simple and clean. There's a nice back air baiting out a low recovery, and he's just right there covering the ledge. Smash DI into grab. We have Stango with a no-jump fox. I don't know if I agree with that air dodge, but I don't know what else he could have done. There's not much you can do. I, I, yeah, you're right. And there's a lot that Stango can do, especially when he's up a full stock here. In game one, a fantastic punish on the left side of Battlefield, eliminating Dave Lu's second stock. I, I feel like what's happening is what we were talking about in the first set, where... Dave is just finding himself off stage at super early percents, and you give Stango all these opportunities to get you, he's gonna, he's gonna get you. That was a really good run off shine, run -off turn, shine turn around back air. I love shine turn around back airs. Shoots Marth way, way out. No way he's coming back from that with no jump. It was a great call out. Ooh, good, good up attack. Stango shielded it, but it didn't matter. Even stocks. Uh, up air, up air. d not quite able to find Ooh, an opening. He, he just falls and. Shield breaker? Fair to neutral B. I mean, he, he, you shouldn't nair. They might smash DI. You might get a reverse hit. Another forward air, not quite as strong. Not able to get the down air. Like that neutral B does work. Good jab to snipe him out. Oh, he Ooh. runs into the fire. Not quite able to get That his was very lucky out. on David's part. Basically gets another. He's playing with borrowed time now. Exactly. He's Living. definitely playing with borrowed time. And that's a great feeling sometimes. See, when you're I like, should not have this stop. I'm, I'm just going to go super in because. I should be dead right now. But it looks like Stango is trying to bring it back, trying to say, give me this, give me this loan back. It is time to pay up. Ooh. Oh. All right, David. He said, I will hold on to this. Let so, me take another stock. Back throw shine. Are we going to see the, oh, nope. Just, just raw forward smash on that ledge dash. Da Dave nods though. He says, you spaced around invincible ledge dash. You knew what I wanted and that's fine. I will hold that. You heading out? Alright, I think he's heading out. Oh, oh, oh game two. Probably. What time is it? Well, yeah, I'm not. I have class tomorrow. Okay. It's 11.20. Maybe. Maybe not. Game two, going We go Pokemon. directly to Pokemon. Not Do Land. not pass Dreamland. Do not collect $200. <laughs> yeah, the, the last Dreamland game definitely sent uh, Dilu straight to jail or straight to the Shadow Realm, depending what kind of Monopoly you play. Comes off with the drill. But David's already down to stop. Because yeah. he got caught off stage again. And that's another thing about Stango. Not only a great punish game, not only uh, exemplary neutral, but also uh, going hand-in-hand -hand with the neutral is fantastic stage positioning and awareness. Every once in a while, sometimes there is a punish that you can go for, but it'd be a little bit risky uh, when he is in the corner. And occasionally he will opt to just run Woo! right by his opponent. Shortening the, that was like a drive-by down air, you know, he was just God. falling. He was drifting They just happened to collide And Marth sword just happened to do its job. My gosh, you know, it looked mm. I mean, you know for for how much Stango how good Stango's look this game. He's only up a stock And David's keeping this close. It was two capital. Ooh, good shine of an offstage Fox Ooh, not able to kill with a wave shine running up smash. Oh, good shine. Just That'll shine. do it. And just like that, this is an even game. Yeah, Marth with not a lot of uh, drift after the up B. Gets reset by the first hit. Of good shield. Wow. Get first hit there. That was a good shield. What? Wasn't playing around. Didn't just, just being safe. Did not want to get forward smash. 78 to 0. Not really able to make use of the rock transformation after invincibility. All right. Drill jab up, or up throw. Gets no, grabbed. Gets nothing out of it. 23%. Definitely need up to air. go bigger. There, that'll send him off. Edge guard. Just stay go get this. Oh, Ooh, good down wow. throw. You see, Marth can cover that. Marth can cover go to ledge. 
just like that. It's, it's a very difficult timing, but you lab it enough and you will get it. Crouch cancels the Nair. Very wise. Netting him. Tech chases. All important grab. Yeah. Uh, uh, we got... Par for the course. Yeah. You play Fox, you, you play want Fo invincibility? Par for the course. You gotta earn your invincibility. Are we going back? Oh. No, we're, go the we're going to Dreamland now. I guess those are the two stages he likes, and those. Oh my god. The Tim Davis. All right. Comes up with a rising name. Oh. Calls out the mistake. Calls up. All right, 94%. Still alive at 117. Oh. And can he reset it back to neutral? He does. Right. David, somehow. That was a 20 second punish. Yeah, barely clinging to life, but making it work with triple up there, 74. Hey, this is kind of an even game. Marth still has a bit of percent left to die, but... And we're talking about Marth percent here on Dreamland, but a little bit too low that for was, That was a too low... I, I think he was stuck in the tumble. And now he's in an awful, oh, awful position. Oh, no. Ooh, no lead. That... Oh. And off stage. <sighs> Clean and simple. Stango yeah. does what he does best, putting himself Ooh, up. That, that was a good two. up air. Reading the jump out of the hit stun there. And the uh, dash attack uh, to call out D.I.N. Down smash, that good should. Down smash. Crouch cancels the up B. So, d -Lu down. Two stocks to three. Up tilt, not quite Ooh. covering on Dreamland. That's why Dreamland's a good stage in this matchup. Mark cannot get through the platforms. He has to up air. He has to short hop up air. Fewer platform follow-ups, but the tech chase still available by wave landing on. Full hop drill. Gets around the pressure. 29%. Just... I don't want to say mediocre because it's really Stango's defense that's getting him out, but lackluster punishes from d end. Every opening he gets, oh, it's not quite I feel like he waited to react to the get up and then just react to the wrong get up there. He waited to try to snipe his get up with a back air and just like went to the wrong side of the platform. What is uh, he doing out there? I thought he was going to shine and trade stocks, yeah, he just... but he decided to up B instead and save it. It worked out, it saved them both. Uh, really, really weird. Oh, gets under that forward air with the sh running shine. Oh, slow get up. 100 plus percent. Sometimes being at a high percent is worth it, you know? That's strategy against Marth. You know, you just kind of wait out the invince, er, we wait out the stall. Oh, that was a really good forward tilt. He knew David was just going to, like, land with no, put no hitbox out. He was just trying to land as fast as possible. Try to get him off stage. If David could hold on to the stop, which he can, because Marth is at that percent where... Ooh. Marth struggles to kill confirm, and as I say that, he kills You can't DI in first. there for that uh, back throw, but I, I'm not sure if forward throw actually leads to the same thing when DI'd in as well. Uh, it's a really nice mix up that Marth has at that percent. Ooh, two down shots. Shine back air. Oh, he need. He, ooh, he oh, let him back off. scooped. Ooh, uh, same situation as the first stock. He, he no reads the miss tech. Time. Yeah. Oh, the down air. Up throw. Up throw. Up air. Sending him through. On the verge of a yet another 3-0 here in Grand He needs finals. to get down. Two stocks to one. He needs to some final, get down to, off the platforms. He does. Gets grabbed. He grabs out. He grabs him out of the jab animation there. 149. Another he, up B. I'm liking these up Bs. Another up B. He's still living. 168 to 84. We will probably there, see that, the end of it. That should do it. 78. Yeah, that'll do it. And congratulations to SS Stango. SS Stango taking yet another lab, improving his record over David to 25-0? I couldn't tell you. We are here. Older than me. The nth week in a row that Stango has taken it. Find this man on Twitter at SS underscore Stango. If you like what you see, give us a follow here at bros underscore calamity. Subscribe for $5 a month. Get several emotes, such as one Stango's face. I couldn't tell you what the emote um, shortcut is. If you like what you saw...